What's David Copperfield's secret? According to a March 2005 lawsuit filed by a Minnesota man named Christopher Roller, the magician has been using Roller's godly powers to perform his tricks on stage without permission. David Copperfield has been using my godly powers to perform his magic. This is a labor dispute in accordance with Minnesota Statute 179.06 for past slash future commission compensation. My website explains my life and my journey to godliness. I believe David Copperfield has been using my godly powers to perform his magic. We've all seen clips of UFO videos. They dance around the sky at the speed of thought. So we know godly powers can coexist on planet Earth. Godly powers means using thought to control action slash results, usually defying explanation and laws of physics. I believe magicians have been granted godly powers by me somehow, but they've been keeping it a secret and keeping the credits from me. If David has godly powers, then he must be using my powers. That, or I need detailed explanation in person of how he does his tricks, performed slash explained in the courtroom with complete confidentiality, and I will leave him alone if I'm wrong, i.e. tricks slash illusions are done conventionally. I've politely asked David via email to show me how his tricks are done with no response. If godly, I want back pay compensation, 10% past slash future career earnings, estimating 10% of past career earnings of over $50 million. Signed, Christopher Roller. While Roller waits for his suit against Copperfield to be resolved, he has other tricks up his sleeve. In June 2005, he filed a similar lawsuit against another famous magician, David Blaine. <laughs> 